the signing period and all this other, and the bull stuff and all everything. Yeah, without a doubt, recruiting is uh, very exciting at this point because we know that the, these kids are going to sign here, and it's, it's it's down to about 14 days. So it's yeah, it's it's getting it, they they don't have to sign, but most of the guys that we've been talking to are going to sign, and um, and then we're talking to a bunch of guys now that we're recruiting that want to sign on the 20th and be over with. So it's, yeah, it's getting intense right now, which is good. Vince was saying it's it's a lot of high school coaches don't seem aware that the early signing, like how all that works. Yeah, a lot of the high school coaches were thinking that if you sign early, you're going to school early. Meaning it's all for the, the early signing period was for the early enrollees, but that's not the case. Every kid can sign on, on, on the 20th and lock in their scholarship and we be locked into going to Kentucky and be done. And then in January, it's just, it's again, we'll be working for, obviously if we have a couple more scholarships left over, we're gonna work on those for the 18 class, but we'll start working on the 19 and 20 class after that. How difficult is it getting the, the bull prep in and the everything else like kind of all together? It is, it's difficult, it is. It's just part of it, you know, it is like that, you know, if you're going to bowl games, this is gonna be part of it. And now with the early signing period, it even intensifies even more. But recruiting's our lifeblood, you know, so, uh, I always say recruiting is like shaving. If, if you don't do it, it shows. So we're gonna we're gonna be recruiting our butts off all the way till till signing day. As you get ready for the bowl game, how are you dividing up the uh, practice for all the quarterbacks? Well, they were pretty much even, and even Danny Clark got some. So um, again, Stephen and Drew both went with the ones today. Uh, I had Gunner get about equal reps. Um, so tr you know, giving him more and more reps, you know, all those guys, and even getting Danny Clark some reps and throwing him in there getting him ready for next year and, and obviously the spring and competition and all that. That's what all this extra practice is and it gets you ready. And then as we as we define it, as we get closer and closer to the bowl, obviously we'll, we'll decline those reps for those guys and increase them for, for Steven and Drew who, who are the one and two right now. But again, Gunner's been playing his butt off, doing a great job, I'm really proud of him. And uh, he's feisty and wants to be out there playing and he's been doing a great job and we're gonna continue to to, to press those guys to do the best we can. Have you seen a change in those quarterbacks who don't get the reps and you really haven't seen very much for months and now all of a sudden they're here? Can you see a change? Well, yeah, they're excited, obviously, and, and they want to go out there and do well, So and they are. Um, and the good thing, too, is all year we've worked on fundamentals because we work on fundamentals the whole time. I work with all the quarterbacks with fundamentals. So we're getting a bunch of reps. We're just not even getting game reps, those kind of situations. Um, and that we'll get a bunch of those here in the next two weeks. How's Drew maybe shaking off the rust, even as he's not been able to play in games throughout the week? Yeah, and you got to understand, I mean, everybody goes, well, Drew last year, you know, he was out, but it wasn't like he was not playing. He was out, like, couldn't do anything. So it's tough to come back from that, and he did, and he's come back from it, and he's really worked himself in a position right now where he's ready to go out there and go play and go execute. How important is it to get a quarterback in this class? Uh, it's always important. I think every year it's important to get a quarterback in the class. So every year we should be signing a quarterback. Can Lynn play quarterback? Yeah, yeah, he can play quarterback. He's done it before. Now, we haven't been training him at playing quarterback, so we've been training, training him at the wildcat position and only a few things. But, yeah, we could take him and play quarterback if we needed to. Are you confident between the, the three guys you've got, a starter? For next year, that can go out and win games. One hundred percent. I really believe that we got we got great quarterbacks here, and we're going to be fine. Whoever, whatever the situation is, and I'm I'm really looking forward to next year. Statistically, Steven started out so 